Hey what's up guys and welcome back to a brand new video on the channel today and a brand new series. Now I did leave a poll in uh, the channel like community description thing uh, asking you guys if you wanted me to do a additional series as well as the Newcastle career mode uh, basically alongside that whether that will be uh, on the day that I don't upload the Newcastle save so I do one day Newcastle, one day um, as you can see here Bradford City and then the next day Newcastle and then I daily upload uh, and then obviously I just upload every day or this series here would probably be like on the weekend maybe two episodes maybe it's Saturday and Sunday but there'll be really long episodes with a lot of content in it um, so let me know down in the comments below if you would rather have this series as a uh, weekend series so you have it on a Saturday and a Sunday um, the Newcastle video would still be uploaded on either the Saturday or Sunday depending on which day is um, if it's a Saturday or a Sunday episode upload um, or would you like to see me do it on the days where I don't upload a video for the Newcastle one which then it gives you something else to watch so then I have one series one day which ha a it literally has like two days basically has two days for you to go you guys to watch it and other people to watch it uh, and then also the day after instead of not having a video um, you'll get to have two series and another video and obviously this one as you can tell it's a bit different it's more of a road to glory career mode because uh, we are starting in League 2 with Bradford. Obviously, they've only got 1.6 million and the aim is obviously to get to the Premier League. Now, this one will be a bit different. The episodes will most likely be longer, more games, and I will most likely sim games in this career mode as well. Uh, the games which uh, we should be winning comfortable in terms of the table will decide that at the point of the, the games just to speed up the series a bit more so we're not stuck in the lower leagues for like, I don't know, for like say we're like 20 episodes in and we're still in League 2 for example but obviously I don't want that to happen so that's what I'm kind of thinking of doing is having loads and loads of gameplay but literally just highlights of just the goals and also simulate some games to speed up a little bit so let me know your thoughts and opinions on this series down below in the comments I'd really appreciate some feedback if you would like to see it as a daily uh, and every other day upload uh, alongside the Newcastle save or would you just like to see it on the weekends for example like Saturday and Sunday for example like I said anyway uh, before we do get into it, please leave a like and like I said, comment your thoughts and opinions on this uh, new series idea. I mean, to be honest, it's more content. M most of you guys suggested that it would be good to have another series alongside. And I did have this series lined up last year at the start of FIFA, but I never got around to doing it. So I already had the thumbnail uh, and the idea there. So that's all good. And make sure to subscribe if you're new around here. As of, I'm rec as of the time I'm recording this, we're about nine or eight or nine subscribers away from 1.6k uh the growth has been insane over the past like week of me starting uploading again since i started uploading again i've gained over 100 subscribers within a week uh again all i can say is thank you and yeah all i'm gonna say is let's get into this save now to start off with i am gonna do world class because it, it a lot of the people that have been watching in the um, Newcastle save, you know, I had I did struggle big time with Newcastle uh, on Legendary with sliders, so I dropped that down to Legendary, and even then the AI was just absolutely battering me. So world, world class kind of seems a bit even for me to play, and it's a bit more enjoyable for myself. And I think for you guys, especially in the last Newcastle episode, uh, you guys seem to really enjoy the gameplay more, and we were kind of picking up better results. Uh, but but world class isn't too easy for me to play, so I kind of feel like this should be good. And we're in a League Two team, so I mean, yeah, uh, we're gonna go drop it to four minutes. Uh, I'm gonna turn off that as well. I don't really want to do that. Transfer window is fine. European competition doesn't involve me. Um, so yeah, basically, like I said, um, it's it's gonna be a series which is gonna be one of those where it's gonna like build over time like this isn't going to be we're not going to be in the premier league after 10 episodes do you know what i mean this is going to be like one of those series which will be on the channel for a while if i'm obviously consistent and actually keep up with the videos this time uh, and then we'll hopefully get to the premier league within obviously the aim is free three seasons isn't it so you win the first one then league one then yeah yeah so around three or four uh seasons so like i said this is obviously going to be alongside the newcastle one don't worry for you Newcastle uh, series followers that you enjoy that you enjoy watching that series that's not going to go away um, this is just basically a bonus series for you guys because the support has been really really good and you guys did want to see um, something else so what we're going to do here is just do all the basics in this episode I might play uh, maybe the first league game or so uh, just depends on transfers because obviously 
transfers, we don't have much money, and obviously we want to have some new signings, I'd say, because I'm not going to know many of these players. That's the that's the first thing I'm going to say. Um, so obviously this is just the normal stuff. We'll look at the uh, objectives of the board. I'm guessing it's promotion. Um, if we go have a little look, obviously the transfer budget is 2.7 actually. It's not too bad. Um, we could even put all of that into lo uh, wage budget to loan players or we could try and bring in a couple of maybe youngsters or older players that are kind of a bit cheap now. Um, but the first thing before we carry on is the comment section. Now I need you guys to flood the comment section with suggestions for me to for me for players for me to sign uh, because like I said 2.7 mil plus what we earned from the tournament. So we're looking at maybe around 3 million to 3.5 to 4 million. Uh, all together uh, to spend now like I said I want either young players who are high potential or pl uh, players that are like mediocre but they'd be really good in League 2 for example so you guys let me know in the comment section down below and that that would really help me you guys smashed it with like over a hundred comments in the first episode of the Newcastle save so I mean I, I expect to see the same again so what we're gonna be doing here is looking at the objectives now they want us to reach the round of 32 in the FA Cup. That's not actually that bad. I can't remember how deep that is into it in terms of like how many... T I, I can't remember like how close that is to like the quarters and stuff. Anyway, um, so they want us to win the title. Okay, wow. Uh, that's... um. Okay, I think that's something we can aim for. Uh, grow one youth academy player by at least five overalls. Again, that's just bringing someone up, taking them off the bench for a few games, starting them, and they're just doing training if I wanted to cheat it that way. But... I'm normally one of those people that doesn't like doing training on players because I feel like it just cheats the game and they, they get high rated really quick. Um, so again, that's something maybe you could let me know in the comment section. Do you want me to train players in this series? Um, because I personally just think it's just not really that fair. But, you know, <clears throat> it is what it is. Anyway, we looked at that one. Reduce player wages. Oh, I hate these ones. I'm not really going to look at that one, to be fair. Um, what we are going to do, though, is look at the team. Now, they play a five at the back formation. Interesting. Now, obviously, I do not know many of these players. That is the problem. Um, so, you guys, if there's any Bradford City fans that stumble across this series, please let me know who your good players are along here. For now, I'm not going to change anyone in terms of like the positions and stuff. I might actually change him to this striker, even though he looks old. Um, but we don't actually have a sub-striker on the bench. Oh, Curtis Guffrey. Now, fun fact, Curtis Guffrey is actually from Jersey, and that's where I'm from. So, I'm going to actually start him up top for this guy. I uh, have Curtis Goffrey up top. Uh, and then, what else are we going to do? To be fair, looking at these players, I don't know any of them, to be honest. Um, so, like I said, let me know who's their best players. Um, th are these two brothers, by any chance? Um, that's just a guess. Probably not. Anyway, we're going to move on into... To be fair, the formation-wise, do you want me to keep this formation? I'm not too sure what to do. For the first, like, preseason games and maybe the first league game before I sign players, I'm going to keep this for now. Um, so let me go down in the comment section below. Uh, other than that, we're going to simulate through the season now, uh, the preseason. Uh, like I said, I'm going to simulate all the games. If we get to the final, I might play it just to see how we get on with the team. Um, but for now, I will be right back until we get to the first game of preseason. Right then, guys, first game of preseason against Rochdale in this tournament. Um, I'm going to simulate them, like I said. If we can get through, uh, obviously I will play the games. Uh, you know how it goes. Okay, we've lost the first game and Curtis Goffrey gets injured as well. That's not what I want to see. Um, but like I said, uh, I don't know who... See, I don't know who this is. Is this guy worth selling? I'm going to reject all offers until uh, I know more about the team and stuff. Uh, Kurt, oh, that's six weeks he's out for. That's not good. Um, so what I'm going to do... I'm actually going to just sit here and... Um, <laughs> simulate the preseason until we get to if we get knocked out or wherever um so what we're going to do simulate again uh or replace yeah because obviously he's up for six weeks so i'm gonna have to just move him up for uh take him out for six weeks anyway so we lost again to be fair i don't see us getting through the groups because yeah yeah we can't okay that's not a good start not a good start but again it's preseason. i'd never i literally never played these games I always simulate them, so this doesn't reflect on how the season's going to go. Uh, it would be nice to get a win, and we do. Hey, Donaldson and McCartan getting a goal each. However, that does mean we go out of the tournament. How much money did we actually get from that? Three, okay, an extra 315. I think that puts us up to around 3 million. Hey, that's not too bad. Now, 
obviously if we go over to the calendar and we check what we've got going so as you can see there is a lot of games in this league uh, deadline day de deadline day sorry is there what I might do is try and get up to the Cambridge game Grinsby and maybe the Rotherham game in this episode as well just because you know we've got a lot of games I want to try and get a lot of the games in um, in these episodes uh, so that's what I'm gonna try and do now so I will be right back until we get to this uh, Cambridge game and I will be right back Alright guys, as you can see here, we're into the first game of the season. Like I said, we're going straight into the league season with this career mode. We're not waiting around for transfers uh, just yet because obviously there's so many games to play before the deadline day. Uh, I just feel like getting a few games under our belt with this team, uh, see who's decent, who needs improving, uh, and hopefully we can <clears throat> start off the league with a win against Cambridge. Let's see how we get on. Here we go, making some plays here with Reeves. Not many options ahead of us. Oh, wow, we got tackled there. Here come Cambridge. Now, obviously, this is the players are definitely a lot different than what it is on uh, the Newcastle save. That's a good tackle there. Uh, unfortunately, we can't keep the ball. Like I said, yeah, a bit different in terms of the players' abilities and stuff. Uh, also, players are actually playing against. So, to be honest, it's not too bad. Uh, we're gonna, it's obviously going to take a bit of getting used to, but can we switch that play? Yes, we can. Are we going to keep this in? Melo. Melo now. Inside. Novak. Donaldson. Donaldson's going for the shot, and it's well wide. But, first chance of the game. It's not actually too bad. It's 14 minutes in or so, and we're looking positive. Here we go now. Novak on the ball. Going to cut it back. Donaldson's there. Can he find him? Donaldson blocked. Can he get a second attempt? Donaldson's still going. Oh my god. Couldn't get the shot uh, anywhere near the net. But un unlucky there from Donaldson. Novak now on the ball, waiting for that run of Donaldson. Oh, here we go. Has he got the pace? Not really. Tackled by the defender. I, was, I, I was thought he had the pace on him, to be fair. But the defender makes a good tackle. But to be fair, we are looking pretty good so far in this game. It's approaching half time now. Uh, can we get one more chance here? Melo wins the ball back. Oh, I should have played that first time. Donaldson plays it across to Novak. Novak, one touch. Can he shoot? And it's a goal! Just before half time. Novak with the first goal of the series. Literally 10 seconds before half time. Lovely bit of play from Melo, the right back, and also Donaldson to find him there with the pass. And we do go 1 0 up against Cambridge. Literally, as the half time also goes, it's 1 0 to Bradford. Oh, Cambridge have got a chance here. Shot is blocked. Back out. Can we get rid of the ball here? Good block by O'Connor there. And a good ball to Donaldson. Right, we need some options here. Not a great first touch. Donaldson, can he get round this defender? Oh, don't know what the defender's doing there, Donaldson. Oh, keeper gets there first. Here come Cambridge now on the attack. Melo outside. Oh, ball played into the box now. O'Connor's got to deal with it, and he does well. I'm really liking this O'Connor so far. Oh, no, we're getting the ball away, though. Not really a great pass, as I praise him, but he's won it back again. And Reeves now inside. Novak. Can we switch this all the way out to Wood? Inside. Akpan. Donaldson. Can he get around this defender? He's not really got the pace on him, does he? Akpan's made a run, though. Can he finish it? Akpan! Oh, what a save by the keeper. Uh, I'm going to bring on Devitt for Makartan here, uh, just to test him out. 64th minute. I'm going to make that sub. Whipped in. Not actually a bad ball. Donaldson's there. Can't get on the end of that one. Can we play this over now? Inside. Can we get a shot off O'Connor? Oh, God, it's a centre-back. In the... I mean, you wouldn't really, really want the centre-back to be taking a shot from there. But anyway, uh, another good chance, though. We're getting close to that second goal. Our oh, ball played across and Woods clears, but that was a really dangerous chance for Cambridge there. And we've actually played some nice football to get up the other end. And Donaldson is through. Can he get past this defender? Donaldson with the shot. Ah, oh, straight at the keeper. Here come Cambridge now on the attack. Oh, the ball's played across. Shot, and it's wide. And that was a really, really close effort there. Now we're making a few subs. Curtis Guffrey's coming up the top, and then I think Cook's coming out in the middle. Uh, I think, if I can remember, uh, 
just to get on some fresh legs uh, because there was a few tired legs out there. It's only the first game of the season, so it's not nothing to worry about. Anyway, Cambridge on the attack now. Been split open there briefly. Can we get the ball back? It's a great tackle. And the ball's cleared, but only as far as the Cambridge player now. We're sitting a bit deep, which is not really what you want to see. Cambridge now. Dangerous position. That's actually a good bit of defending. Curtis Guffrey. Oh, can he find Novak? I don't think Novak's got the pace. Or I mean, it looks like he does here. Going to cut it back. Oh, it's a poor pass. Two minutes of out of time now. We've got the ball back. Can we go on the up the other end and get a counter attack on the go? Guffrey now. Nice ball. Waiting for that run of someone. Curtis Guffrey's making a run. So is Cook. Can he play it to the back post? Yes, he can. Oh, it's off the crossbar. Rebound. Oh, he's put it over. Guffrey nearly gets his goal. Oh. I mean, we'll take it though. 1 0 win in the first game against Cambridge. And to be fair, we played some really, really good football. Anyway, moving on into the next game. Right, guys, moving on into the next game of the episode. We are up against uh, Grimsby Town away from home. Let's see if we can carry on our good form from the first game of the uh, season in this game. And we've actually won the ball back straight away. Waiting for that run of Donaldson. Is he going to make a run? Yes, he is. Donaldson's through in the first minute of the game. Oh, maybe he's right-footed because in the previous game as well, the left-foot shots weren't great. Something I'm going to have to have a look at. But anyway, nice positive start. And oh, I thought we were going to get the ball again. But Grimsby now on the attack. Slowly but surely coming up into our half. Here they come. Uh, I'm actually kind of liking this five at the back formation. Oh, that's a foul. Um, the first game was really good. I felt we controlled the game, uh, especially when we got uh, attacked against. Uh, I felt like we did all right defensively. So I might keep it. Um, we'll have to see how it goes in uh, further down the season because uh, we might have to change it. But for now, it's going all right. Uh, O'Connor at the back. I'm really enjoying him. Uh, and Donaldson as well. Oh, Wood. That's lovely. Wood's got. Oh, my God. Look how much space he's got on this left side. He's going to go all the way. Woods. Woods. Oh, straight at the keeper. No way, man. Still got the ball, though. Reeves. Inside to McCartan. Oh, he's got caught there with the ball. Oh, that was a really good chance there from Wood, our left wing back. Inside to Donaldson now. McCartan on the right foot. Can he get a shot off? McCartan. Oh, he's put it wide. Good effort, though. Here come Grimsby now. Shot is saved by O'Donnell. Good save by the keeper there. Uh, corner now for Grimsby. Decent chance that. Can we get rid of the ball with an awkward one? Just going to hoof that away. Only as far as a Grimsby player. But Novak should get that and he does. Can we switch the play now? Oh, it's not really a good ball though. Donaldson now chasing the ball down. Oh, nearly got that as well. Here we go now. Novak. Oh, the defender stepped up. Novak, has he got the pace to get away from the defenders? I think he does. Can he finish? Yes, 1-0. Novak, bottom corner. Lovely, lovely goal. That's his second goal of the season. Back-to-back -back goals in back-to-back -back games. Novak, number nine. Lovely little finish into the bottom corner there. And that does make it 1-0 to Bradford in the 28th minute. Nice play here. Down the right-hand side. Mellor now. Can he whip in a ball? Oh, back post. There was someone there. We can't get them to... The, oh, Donaldson's offside. Oh, actually, he wasn't offside. Okay, that's a bit strange. I thought he was. Um, we've got the ball now. Throw in. Oh, Donaldson can't get around that defender, unfortunately. But again, really not another really positive start uh, to this game. Uh, obviously, <clears throat> Grimsby are keeping the ball. Quite a bit more than us, but that's, I mean, if you look at the scoreline, it doesn't really matter. Can he play the ball through? Akpan. Donaldson's there. Oh, he can't get the ball back to him. Here come Grinsby now. Down on the right-hand side. Not really sure what to do here, but O'Connor, the other O'Connor now, wins the ball. Here comes Wood. Oh, look at this football. Oh, he's not going to get there, though, is he? Or is he? Oh, he's unlucky. Again. Counter attack is on for Grimsby. Can we get rid of the ball? I don't mind it getting played in there because when they do stuff like that. Oh, well, I've just given the ball straight back to them again. Oh, it's a cheap bit of play to give away. But this time we can 
get rid of the ball. Oh, that's another really weak pass. That's something I need to get used to is the passing for these lower rated players. Um, wow, this O'Connor is really good at the back. Uh, that's not a foul, is it? No. Anyway, <clears throat> half time there. 1 0 to Bradford. Here comes Grimsby now. Ball whipped in. Keeper should get that comfortably. I'm going to throw it out to the left back. Woods. Going to go down to Donaldson now. We've gone all the way from the goalkeeper to the striker now. Can we actually get this ball across to the right back? Yes, we can. Oh, Donaldson's through. We can find him. Oh, what's he doing? Why is he just staying? Oh, I don't know what's up with him in this game. Not going too well. O'Connor again. What a beast, man. Honestly, he's really, really good. Novak on the ball. Slides through Donaldson. Oh, again. We're literally just that one pass or that one dribble away from getting through on goal. But I think a second goal is coming in this game. Hopefully it's to us. Donaldson over to Novak. Oh, Novak, what a touch that is. Novak should be in and he should score. And he does. It's 2-0. Novak getting his second goal of the game and his third goal of the season. Lovely, lovely ball from Donaldson. And a lovely first touch from uh, Novak. And again, a lovely finish. 2-0 now. That should be game over. Here come Grimsby now. Last few minutes of the game. Ball's whipped to the back post and it's just gone over the crossbar. I'll play this one short to O'Connor. Inside to the other O'Connor. Nice bit of play there. Devitt. Gonna wait for that run of Guffrey. Oh, why is he playing it that far over? Guffrey would have been through there. Oh, look at this play. Oh, this play is beautiful. Kovac for the hat trick. Kovac. Oh, it's saved by the keeper. That's probably going to be the end of the game anyway. And it is. What a win against Grimsby away. 2-0. Novak getting two more goals for the season. That makes it. That makes his tally go up to three. Uh, we're going to jump into the post-match press conference. Just to answer the questions which the press have to ask us. Um, normally, I don't include this in the episodes. But just because um, it was a big win. Uh, a nice result. I'm going to add this. Um, two goals, how happy I am. A uh, great performance from Novak again. Really, really nice to see. Um, next one, did you expect to beat Grimsby? Um, I mean, I just say, I'll just say that. Just, I don't want to be too cocky, if you want to say that. Uh, how pleased are you today with the win? Um, time to focus on the next match, I think. I'm not going to say anything about scoring more goals. Um, and that's going to be the end of the post-match interview. Now, the next game is the EFL Cup. I don't know which one this is. This is the Carabao Cup, really early stages. Um, I think it is. Um, so we're going to go look at the calendar quickly. Um, so for, for now, this is going to be the end of the episode, guys. Just because I want to get this episode out to you. Normally, I'll be playing like four to five to maybe even six games per episode. Uh, but now, just for now, we're just going to be playing the quick games. Obviously, deadline day is going to be in the next episode. Um, so really, really need your suggestions on signings down below. And obviously we'll get all of these games you see on screen in the next episode. Uh, so thank you guys for watching. Leave a like, comment your thoughts on the series as a whole and obviously transfer suggestions. And make sure to subscribe if you're new around here. And I'll catch you guys in the next episode. Peace.